All right. On the left-hand side, we see something called table of triads, showing triads in three dimensions, and we've got a blue and a pink color highlighted and a bunch of triplet letters in a row. On the right-hand side, we also see a table of triads, but this time the pink and the yellow are highlighted, and we have a few different triplets selected out. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Evolving Spaces, Episode 8, Chapter, Move, Finesse, Acclimate, Duel. In this episode, we re-entered by reflecting that making moving sound recordings versus moving image recordings are different. Intriguingly different. In fact, we should say that there. We also, in our 3D composing exhibit, have been getting some feedback that we like quite a bit. And we've also been evolving our work practices about what we do first thing in the morning and later in the morning and what we do in the afternoon. And we finally, kind of the big aha is that our 3D and music composing exhibit is a further experiment in sharing composing. It is 3D online versus a YouTube stream, which is 2D online. So let's go to that 3D online. Here, these are the same uh, tables of triads. And the point is that this is a custom scale. This is a custom scale. And we're used to seeing black and white keyboards that look like this. But up here, the keys are color coded and some of them are missing. For example, here's a C, here's the C, but there's no D flat or E flat or E, D flat D, there's an E flat here. But I can't click these and I'm jumping up to here. So basically one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six notes in that in that custom scale. This is a custom scale. And there are two ways to look at it. It could be saying you start on C start on the C, which is like this one. Or this one says we're going to start on A flat. So we start on A flat, which is here. Same six note. However, and this is the part where the music theory comes in, in one system, that's considered a rest chord, but in this system, it's considered dominant. And if we were composing, a typical way to compose would to take a rest energy, which is a tonic, and a restless energy, which is uh, pink. So we might go from tonic, urge, and come back to rest. But we don't have that option up here. There's no, there's no, there's no blue chords down here. What happened to them? Well, because we're looking at it in terms of a different scale, if we want to go from rest to the best we can do is go from subdominant, which is a float, a float. So it could go like this, float, to urge, and those are obviously different uh, sequences of chords. So the idea, and this was the aha, is that you can share the process of composing using custom scales and using triads and dyads and all that. The other thing that we worked on was what we called the Walk By Project, which is a stereo recording. We played that last time. So we're taking more recordings walking by the bayou with our phone. Our phone has a top and a bottom mic, and it turns out that the bottom mic is... Uh, the bottom mic is the right side, and the top mic is the left side. So experiments are continuing on that. So that ends today's recap. 
What we really like about what we've been doing is, is this big aha that we've really just had, which is that we're we've been we've been streaming on 2D online for quite a while now, and we did an exhibit a year ago in 3D and music uh, piano kits, where all you did was click on the pianos. Um, but we just showed you the black and white pianos and the color-coded pianos. And this year, we extended that to trying to do what we call a composer's toolkit. So I like doing that. And who knows if a 3D in music is the, is a, the good or best way to share composing, but it certainly complements uh, in a different way doing the same uh, process in 2D and, of course, online and, of course, in-person live if you are fortunate enough to be able to get together online live. So our ideas for next time are to record a voice tour. We have a colleague that we're going to do collaborative composing with in the 3D Music Exhibit. Keep exploring our walk-by project and what we call the dual project, which was those two different ways of looking at the scale. And shout-outs to Silent Lurker and Methodic Innovator. Tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care. Do come back and do keep on streaming.